you. Good morning. We are now at the airport in Thailand in Phuket. Just uh, cleared security and checked in our bags. And we are at our gate now, which is gate number 12. Uh, we're going to be boarding in about 15 minutes' time. Flight's going to be about six hours, six and a half hours to Dubai. So it's about the same time as Dubai to London. Yeah. Um, and that's it, really. We've been awake since five, quarter past five. Yeah. So. Um, Had a light breakfast, and yeah, we took, took a cab. Took us an hour to get here from the. A cab driver was hotel. hilarious. Yeah, a cab driver was funny. Uh, this is the airport here in Phuket. Got a subway. They got a little mini duty free. Uh, not a big one. And then that's our plane there behind us. It's not the A380. Yeah, it's not the A380. I think it's the Boeing 777. 777. So. So Emirates have really since we've left London, Emirates have such crap movies. We've yeah, got one or two good ones, but it's, it's not as good as. They like, haven't updated the their year. films. Yeah. yeah. It's so rubbish. So. Um, just sleep. She's gonna sleep, I'll see how I feel. And our next vlog will be when we arrive at Dubai. Bye. Hello, good evening. We are in Dubai. We landed here safely. Uh, we got here, well, we got to the hotel about half two. Um, immigration, there was a bit of a queue, but we eventually got out. Got a taxi, it was 15 minutes away from the airport, so it's not too far. And uh, yeah, we checked in the hotel. Hotel's near the Palm, so it's on Jumeirah Street. Um, the weather's so nice. The weather is amazing. It's, it's like hot, but it's such a nice cool breeze. Yeah, well. so it's a lot like you can probably tell from her hair, it's, it's breezy, but it's, it's, really nice. it's 29 degrees, but it's uh, it's windy, so it's really, it's really nice. nice. Um, so we're just walking around now, just exploring the local area to see. I'm going to get some food. Um, so this street. is the main street here. Oh, look, second, there's a street. The street that we're on is called Second December Street. No, Second December Street is that way. This oh. is Jumeirah Street. Okay, yeah, that yeah. way. It's yeah, there's a street that's next to us called Second December Street, which is so weird. weird. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you look behind me, you can see the UAE flag right there. Uh, there it is. Um, it doesn't probably look that big in the camera, but it's huge. It's very, very big. And it's right next to us. That's pretty nice. So yeah, we're on the Jumeirah Street. Um, just over... Uh, hold on. I'm trying to get my... There. No, that's the um, Burj. Yeah, that's the Burj Khalifa. That we can see. You see it from anywhere. I know. Yeah. It looks nice. This, this long strip has loads of restaurants, food places, shops. Carry walking down and you end up on the beach. Yeah, so if you can't walking down and turn right, you'll end up on the beach and the palm itself. So yeah, that's our plan for this evening. Gonna go and eat, just explore the local area. And that's it for today, really. Um, gonna be a bit tired anyway, because of our flight, so we're not gonna do anything hectic. So we shall see you lot tomorrow. Good morning everyone, this is day two of our Dubai trip. Uh, we are now at Dubai Marina Mall, so it's now just gone past half ten in the morning. We woke up about eight o'clock, had breakfast, breakfast was nice, and we are now at the Marina Pier 7. You can see behind me. So this is where we are going to be taking our speedboat tour of the Palm this morning at 11 o'clock so we're just waiting for that to start and then after that we're just going to stay around the marina today and um, that's our plan so we'll just show you a little bit around here <coughs> I think the marina at night looks really nice yeah it's quite nice I think we're just going to chill out here today go to the marina mall Dubai marina mall is it marina mall? no Dubai marina what's the mall called? it's marina mall marina mall um, and then the cab driver recommended JBR. JBR. He said there's nice restaurants, <coughs> the beach is nice, and it's apparently really nice there. Everyone's getting busy now. <laughs> so that's our plan for today. 
Um, so the speedboat is going to be about 90 minutes long and then off that we're just going to stay around the marina, probably go to JVR and just explore the area around here and then in the evening we're just going to go back to the hotel and chill. Very nice weather, perfect weather. I think we're probably not going to the hotel either. 29 degrees maybe, yeah. 29 degrees. It's so, so, so nice. And it's not humid, it's just nice and hot. And it's got a bit of a breeze as well, so it's pretty good. Oh, by the way, this is my new wife. She looks beautiful today. Normally, she always oh. says she doesn't have makeup on. It's because it was really hot in Thailand. Like, but I don't even recognise who she is. Sweated off and stuff. And, you know, wearing a very nice dress. <laughs> Looking all nice. Um, so, yeah. We shall see you later. Hello. We are on our speedboat tour yacht. Hold on tight. Yeah, we're hold on tight. You might not be able to hear me, but we're going to show you a little bit of the surrounding. That's the Burj Al Arab Hotel behind us. We are now back off our speedboat tour, which was amazing. So fun. So much fun. We saw the Atlantis, um, we saw the palm itself on the outside. You can't go in the palm because of it being private, so they don't let any boats go inside. Um, and then after that, we went to the Burj Al Arab Hotel, took pictures there and took some videos. And now we're back. It was an yeah. hour and a half. They're making, really, really oh, good. also they're making a um, second, is it the... So they're making a second hotel next to the Atlantis called the Royal Atlantis. And um, it's going to be bigger than the actual Atlantis and yeah. it's in construction. Should be finished by October 2020. So a lot of the construction work they're getting done here is going to be completed before Expo 2020, which starts in October next year. Um, runs for six months. So they're trying to get a lot of things it's completed. I think the best time to Dubai because it's going to be... Oh, nearly fell then. Do you think it's the best time to go to Dubai? Yeah, so if you're planning to come to Dubai... One second, I'm just trying to get out of here. How'd you get out? Just stuck behind some glass. Excuse me, which way is out? Please touch the exit button on your left. I can't even. Okay. Oh, that one, that one. Oh. Oh, okay. So weird. They were useless. Yeah. Um, I can't remember what I was saying now. Yeah, so a lot of the construction they're trying to get it completed before Expo starts in October next year. Probably the best time to come yeah. to Dubai will be next year, October. Uh, within them six months. Um, I would actually recommend this speedboat more than the yacht. Yeah, it was about £23 per person. The yacht was more expensive, but the boat's better because you can Sorry, it you can go closer to the the palm and then you can take pictures and it was yeah. just fun. It was really fun. It was, it was fun. really good. I mean, three hours in a yacht would probably just get boring. Yeah. This but I think it would be nice if you're doing like a romantic thing. It would yeah. be nice the yacht, but um, I would actually prefer this. Now we're just going to walk around the marina. Just going to spend the day in the marina now, so... Oh, I need some nice coffee. We shall see you later. Hello. So we're sitting in Dubai Marina. 
well, we're in the mall. Um, I just got a cafe Nero because hotel um, coffee was really rubbish. So, she needs some proper coffee. Um, and yeah, we're just shopping about, uh, having a look around. Got some nice goodies, some bath and body works. I feel like it's more expensive here than America, but can't go wrong with sanitizers. Um, what else? So Marks and Spencer's behind you. I know, Marks and Spencer's there. That's so cool. Uh, Christmas one. Like Christmas Marks really and Spencer. Cool. Um, and yeah, we just had a look around. Shazad bought a nice bracelet. Well, you know, let's just say it's a little gift for him for being a lovely husband. Oh, <laughs> thank you. You show it, it's really cute. I like it, it's nice. It's different. Yeah. So he's got a little souvenir to take back in the memory of our one year trip to First Thank time you. together in Dubai. So we've both been in Dubai together, but never together. That didn't make sense at all. <laughs> we've I been mean, Dubai together, but never together. <laughs> we've both been to Dubai separately, but never the first time together, obviously. So yeah. <laughs> That's a <laughs> blonde moment, what the hell? I think it's a little bit of your hair. Your blonde streaks. Whatever. Um, so yeah, so I've got a lovely latte. A nice chocolate muffin for both of us to share. It's such a nice one. So yeah, we'll catch up later. So behind us is called the Dubai Eye and it's still under construction, it's going to be finished by next year October. It's going to be bigger than London Eye. It's going to be the biggest um, tourist ferris wheel in the world. Um, so yeah, it's going to be much bigger than London Eye. So that's, just... that's under construction, very very big. So we are at the beach area, just soaking, up. soaking our feet in the water, cooling ourselves. So it's loads and loads and loads of people here. See behind me. This area is called the Jumeirah Beach Residence. JBR, sure. Um, so yeah, we are just gonna have a little walk around here, have a little walk around JBR and relax. How nice is the view? <laughs> no, I wanted to say that. Oh right, okay. Yeah. This is like so we're at the Dubai Marina still. We just spent the whole day here. Um, and now we've just been chilling for the past hour, hour and a half. Went to JBR and we just came here, we're just having some drinks. Um, but look how nice the view is. Hello drinks. <laughs> look how nice the view drink is. It's so nice at night time. And the way they decorated all the palm trees. Um, shortly we're going to be going to back to the Dubai Marina Mall. There's a McDonald's up there, and we're going to. He just wants halal McDonald's, basically. Binge in McDonald's. So that's our plan. And yeah, and then we're just going to just chill and see where the night takes us. So we are at McDonald's now. I've been waiting for this moment for two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> I've got Big Mac with large. I think it's extra large, so that's my Big Mac. Chicken nuggets. I'm gonna show it. Look at that. That is a halal Big Mac. Can you believe it? I've had it before, but I've He's been waiting like for it for ages. Basically. So I've got that. And then I've got massive chips. I think it's extra large chips. Chicken burger for the side. Chicken nugget. This is all mine, by the way. She's just got a Big Mac and a milkshake and chips. So this is all mine. Um, and then. So basically, look how massive these straws are. They look like exhaust pipes. Yeah. At least they're plastic. <laughs> McDonald's thinking of you back home. <laughs> so that's a chocolate Oreo milkshake in McDonald's. So good. Which is pretty cool. 
So I'll take a. Actually, you know what? No, I'm gonna eat in peace, and I'm not gonna show you <laughs> my food. Yeah, we're kind of hungry. All from all that so walking. yeah, we will vlog once we finished. We didn't even have lunch. I know, we didn't have no lunch. <laughs> we'll vlog once we finish. So this is the video after I've eaten. And the food was amazing. I finished it all. I'm still hungry. I can probably still get another Big Mac and maybe a cheeseburger. But I'm going to wait until Friday. Not Friday. Saturday? Saturday. And get it at the Dubai Mall where the Burj Khalifa is. So we're going to go to McDonald's there on Saturday. I'll You're going to go to McDonald's. I'm going to go to McDonald's. I wasn't a big fan to be honest. I just found it a bit bland. Honestly, like, no. I don't know, like, what's it? I think it's such a guy's meal. I thought, oh, because obviously in the UK you can't have it, so I thought, let me try it. It was alright, but at least I know I'm not missing out. Yeah, but I think it's just because it's so bland. Like, it's not even like it's not even like a bland. Right now, I can get no, that. I, I don't get... think I... The Oreo milkshake is nice. I don't think I'll yeah. be having um, McDonald's again. The chocolate Oreo milkshake is really nice. But I don't know. She wasn't a fan, but I love it. I could have this every single day. But I'm going to wait until Saturday, not tomorrow. Let my stomach settle back on Saturday and get a few more meals. Bye. <laughs> It's just gone 10 past 12 in the afternoon and Juma Prez is going to be at half 12. Behind me is the Jumeirah Mosque, which is uh, very beautiful. Um, it's just on Jumeirah Street. It's about a 15 minute walk from our hotel. You can see right there the Burj in the background and there's a mosque. So it's a pretty nice view from here. I'm going to be going inside. The call to prayer on the Azan has just happened. So I'm going to go inside and pray. And it was beautiful. I've not heard the Azan like that um, out loud in public for quite a while now. The last time, I think it was back in yeah, Dubai when I went to Dubai the previous time. So yeah, that's today. I'm um, going to be going to Juma. Kainat's back at the hotel. And we're just going to be going to the Gold Sook today, later on this evening. And, um, and then yeah, probably just chilling in the evening after that. Um, and that's it. So I'm going to rush inside and see you guys later. Hi guys, we are now at the Gold Souk. Uh, it's just gone nearly half four in the afternoon. Uh, that is a necklace. Massive, massive necklace. Mad. Imagine wearing that, you get back pains. Imagine having that on your, on your wedding day. I don't think you know, I think maybe like someone Great that was crazy. But yeah, this is the Gold Sook, so we're just going to walk down the street now and go straight down. Um, it's like a market area. For gold. Check it out. I thought we'd just come here, have a look at it, have a look at it, and um, see what we can find if we want to buy anything and see what prices they do here. Um, you might notice my beard. I've it's had nice. it. I've had it done like <laughs> Arab style. He we went to one of so where we are in Jumeirah Road. There's so many Arab salons. So he went after Juma. He went straight there. Very done. Thank you. Looks alright. Cost nice, me I five pound. Not bad. So yeah, this is our. <laughs> <laughs> this is our gold sook tour. See you later.
It's our last full day here in Dubai, so we thought we'd come to the Dubai Mall today to have a look around. Last minute look, shopping. Last minute shopping, look at the Burj Khalifa, which is right next to it. Go to Sephora. There you go, in English. Um, we're standing right next to the waterfall right now, which looks really, really nice. Uh, we're here all day, we're just going to be walking around, having a look at the shops. Having McDonald's later on, can't wait. And that's it, really. What I'm going to say. No, we're going to see the fountain later as well. Yeah. I mean, I've seen there, but it doesn't, get, it, doesn't, it doesn't get old. Yeah, we're going to go and nice. see the fountain uh, display, which they start around sunset outside. Yeah. So that will be nice. Um, and yeah, that's it, really. So today is going to be Dubai Mall Day. Hello, so this is my McDonald's meal today. This is my final McDonald's meal in Dubai. So I got myself a quarter pounder with cheese and a grilled chicken that is really nice. sandwich. Which looks pretty good. That's the quarter pounder. A jug of Coke. Big jug of Coke. Kinda got some boring Chinese. I actually wanted um, boring, and I got. I'm joking. Curry, but nowhere So and some chips. So that's my meal today. Hello. Hi guys. So it's now coming up to eight o'clock in the evening. Uh, we just had some food. We're still at the Dubai Mall, and every half an hour they have the fountain show underneath the Burj. So we've got five minutes before it starts and you can see behind us the Burj Khalifa all lit up. So nice. Looking very, very nice. Very tall. So there's literally hundreds and hundreds of people here, probably in the thousands. Which you can see all the way around. I'm going to try sneaking again. <laughs> And if you look all the way on the other side of the river as well, there's people. So the next video is going to be the fountain show. So enjoy.
flaming, dude. That is just so nice, isn't it? Like, only in Dubai they can do that. <laughs> On a massive tall building. I don't know where that came from, but yeah, that was really nice. We were about to leave and we saw that, so we're like, oh, that looks so cool. I've not seen that before. I've not seen it before either. I've seen like flags and lights and stuff, yeah. but not actual. I think they just change it like every every few months and stuff, they just change things. Anyway, that was a little teaser. Bye, Burj. Bye. Good morning. It's our departing day from Dubai and the final day of our holiday. So, so we, sad. I know, we're literally just soaking up the last bit of sun out Before here. Before we hit back UK. Before we hit back to the cold and miserable London weather. So it's just coming up to half 11 in the morning here in Dubai. Our flight's at half two in the afternoon and we'll be getting to Heathrow at half six in the evening. So I'm the, not looking forward to it. Can we stay an extra day or an like extra two weeks? I, like I've got a week off anyway. She's going back to work on Tuesday. No. So I can still relax and chill. So Why don't sad. you go back and I'll stay here? I'll meet you back on Friday. Couldn't do. I feel like. No. But the sun is out, the weather is lovely, and yeah, this is going to be our last vlog of our holiday trip. Hope you have enjoyed everything and all the videos, and we shall see you lot soon. Bye. Bye.